Get ready for a new season. Daniel chapter 2 verses 20 and 21. Daniel answered and said, Blessed be the name of God forever and ever, for wisdom and might are His. And He changes the times and the seasons. He removes kings and raises up kings. He gives wisdom to the wise and knowledge to those who have understanding. One of the ways in which God works in our lives is by orchestrating the change of seasons in our lives. The psalmist said, my times are in his hands. And as we see in nature, so also God works in our lives. Our life is lived in seasons and God uh, unfolds our lives uh, in seasons, so to speak, just as we see in nature. There are various seasons that run through the course of a year. So also in our lives, there are various seasons that God takes us through. And it is God who orchestrates the change of seasons. And we must get ready for a new season. Not necessarily because it's the end of a calendar year and we're getting ready to move into a calendar year, but also because God himself is occupied or busy with what is happening in our lives and he prepares us for the purposes that he wants to release in each season. Uh, typically we say there is a reason for every season or we could put it like this, there is a purpose, a God appointed purpose for every season that he orchestrates for us. So when one season is coming to a close and God is transitioning us into another season, it just means that there is a shift in the purposes that he is releasing through us. A shift in the purposes may not necessarily mean a change in purpose, but it could mean the same purpose, but being expanded, being enlarged, uh, the vision is being uh, ex uh, increased, or the scale of what God is going to do is changing. And so we need to accommodate the new season that he's bringing on our lives. Now, it is true that sometimes a, a new season that God puts upon us can be a drastic change. Just like you go from um, winter into spring, or you go from fall into winter, where the changes are quite drastic. Uh, the temperatures change and the weather conditions change. Similarly, there could be times in our lives when the seasons change and there are, uh, there's a big shift, a big change and what we're doing and the nature of what's, what, what's happening and the purposes that are being unfolded in our lives. So it is very important for us to prepare, to get ready for the next season, get ready for a new season. And so I wanna present that word to you as uh, you begin to consider what God has for you, in, God, God has in store for you. Get ready for a new season, God, changes seasons. Our times are in his hands and as he unfolds and brings about a new season, we need to prepare ourselves for the new season he's bringing into our lives. Let's pray together. Father, we thank you that our times are in your hands and that you, O oh God, changes, change times, you change seasons. Help us, Lord, to get ready for the new season, for the next season that you're causing to come upon our lives. Help us to understand what you're doing and prepare well for it. In Jesus' name, amen. Thank you for tuning in to Living Supernaturally. For more resources to strengthen your spiritual walk, please visit apcwo.org.